and welcome. My name is Prue or Prue LaRue and today I'm here to talk to you about one little product and this is the Australis Stamp It Winged Eyeliner. This goes for I believe just about $17 but I got it for half price, $8.50. Australian, which like in the US would be like $6. Anyway, the Stamped Wing Eyeliner has been around for quite a while. Vamp Stamp came out then the, in Australia, which I believe is like more US based and then there was the Quick Flicks which goes for like 40 bucks for like and you get two of them it's very confusing but the girls at beauty news did a really good video on the quick flicks when that came into store in australia i'm sorry i just read, i don't have lipstick let me fix that so sorry about that i've just uh fixed myself up anyway this goes for 17 dollars. i got it for half price australis apparently do 50 percent off sales every night again if you're in australia which is a solid time to get on to their brand they've been advertising a lot of 30 percent sales to me since then but like no you gave me 50% off so I will wait to the next 50% off because there's pretty much no Australis product that I would ever be like oh my god yay I need to try it now but just as this came out uh, at the end of January I was able to get this for $8.50 so it has two sides to it it has the felt tip like texture liner which is just a bit too big for me and then it's got the stamp the quick flicks comes with two different ones to show you two different ones for like each side which just, just seems confusing to me but this one just has one stamp and I did this whole sort of look about three hours ago so this is just me coming back after that when I stamped this in that video it had been laying flat so the stamp was a bit funny so I thought while we're here now I will stamp it for your pleasure I'm going to do a gentle stamping. Yeah. So just while I've been away, I've had it sitting that way with the stamp down. And that has definitely been a lot better for it. So next to it, I just did one super hard and one super light. So you can sort of see you can get kind of different sizes with it. You can fix it up. But the big thing with this one, I think this is how it works. Can you see it well in there? No, I, don't. I think I need to put it on a piece of paper for you. All right, sorry, this just took a while to sort of get the right kind of shape to show you. I don't know if you, I'm trying. So on this stick, it has, um, can you see how it's like, uh, got, there we are, there we are, all right, we're in, we're in business. See how there's like a triangle like that? And that is sort of how you can make it fit either side of your eyes. Um, I've had a lot of fun having a stamp. I've never been able to do wing eyeliner, eyeliner. I really suck at it, but I was able to do it with this. I do find that because I have really hooded eyes, I just, I need something smaller to go there. So I do tend to use the Fenty fly liner just because it is a smaller tip. So I'll show you at the end in comparison to this to wing it out. So I'm going to show you a demonstration of it, of me putting it on my eyes as they are currently now. Then I'll come back and talk to you more about it if you're interested. So that is the wing line liner. If you've been watching my videos, you've definitely seen me play with this a bit and I do enjoy it. I think it is absolutely worth $8.50. I don't think it's worth any more than that. Um, sometimes it's a bit patchy when it goes on, but you can fix that up. And I just find it really useful for getting that line to do, to go on. Um, this isn't for someone who can do winged eyeliners. If you can do winged eyeliners, like don't even bother with a stamp. But if you can't do wing liner, my god, this is this is amazing. I'm so happy. I seriously, if I didn't have this stamp, these this liner wouldn't be on currently. But you do have to play with it and get used to it. It is a bit of a shiny product, and just for the same time that I'd be wearing this eye look, I did have some swatches that I put on. I put a picture up of what they looked like before. But this is the Australis Stamp It. Shall I stamp it and the Fenty fly liner? 
did a really thin line of that that's just washed away when I've washed my hands. You can see they're both a metallic shiny formula and they're, they're good. I never understand why people want matte black liners. Like you're wearing liner, just be shiny. It's fun. Anyway, I really hope you enjoyed today's little rundown on the Astralis Stamp It Wink Liner. Let me know if you picked it up. Let me know if you've tried a stamp liner and what you think of it. Uh, thank you so much for stopping by. You warm my heart. I absolutely appreciate it and adore you. Mwah.